Today I will discuss the term mole and then we will then we will study the gram atom. At first we discuss the mole. The term mole was introduced by Ostwald Ostwald in 1896 1896 it is the latin word it is the latin word which stands for heap or pool heap or pile or collection or collection in chemistry Ostwald defined it defined it as Mole is defined by the Westward in 1896 as the number of atoms present in 12 gram of carbon 12. That is the total number of atoms, total number of atoms present in present in 12 gram or 12 gram of the carbon 12 is known as mole. It has been observed that the total number of atoms present in 12 gram of carbon 12, carbon 12 is the carbon isotope, the total number of atoms present in 12 gram of carbon 12 isotope is 6.02 into 10 to the power 23. So this number is known as the mole. In other words, we can say one mole is equal to 6.02 into 10 to the power 23. Just like one dozen per hour, one dozen is equal to 12. One pair, one pair is equal to 2. Similarly, one mole is equal to 6.02 into 10 to the power 23. So, it is the number of number. So, if number of particles is given, we can calculate the mole of that particles. For example, 6.02 into 10 to the power 23 is equal to 1 mole. Is equal to 1 mole. If number of particles is 1, then number of mole will become 1 upon 6.02 into 10 to the power 23. It will be the mole. If number of particle is equal to n the mole is formulated as number of particle n upon 6.02 into 10 to the power 23 it will become the mole so it is the formula of mole that is mole is equal to number of particles number of particles divided by 6.02 into 10 to the power 23 it is the formula of the mole formula of the mole the number is 6.02 into 10 to the power 23 23 is considered as the Avogadro's number Avogadro's number in honor of Emidio Avogadro's Emidio Avogadro so the mole may be formulated as number of particles number of particles upon Avogadro's number that is Na Na stands for the number of Avogadro's number that is 6.02 into 10 to the power 23 suppose <coughs> Suppose you have given you have given three point zero one into ten to the power eighteen is the number of number of particles number of particles in a number of particles of an atom. In this case, the mole will become calculated as below by using this formula that is 63.01 into 10 to the power 18 divided by 6.02 into 10 to the power 23. 
it will become it will become solved as 1 upon 2 into 10 to the power 23 will become raised to the up, um, minus 5 that is 0 0.5 into 10 to the power minus 5 will become the mole of the particles present in this. Now we want to calculate, now we want to discuss the gram atom, gram atom, gram atom it is also known as gram atomic mass, gram atomic mass, it is defined as that, it is defined as the total mass of the atom total mass of the atom present in one mole of that substance in this case the actual mass should be taken in other words gram atom or gram atomic mass is defined as the actual mass of the atom present in one mole of that substance is known as the gram atom for example total number of total number of total sorry the actual mass of the actual mass of an atom actual mass of an atom present in present in present in one mole of the of that atom is known as is known as gram atom gram atom suppose we want to calculate the gram atom of hydrogen atom hydrogen atom we know relative mass of relative mass of hydrogen atom is equal to 1.008 u so the actual mass actual mass of hydrogen atom will become 1.008 into 10 to the power into 1.66 into 10 to the power minus 24 gram now the actual mass actual mass of one mole of one mole of hydrogen atom it will become 1.008 into 1.66 into 10 to the power minus 24 into 6.02 into 10 to the power 23 gram when it will be calculated it will become almost equal to 1.008 gram because 10 to the power 23, 20 to the power minus 24 will become equal to the 10 to the power minus 1. That is when 10 to the power minus 24 and 10 to the power 23 is multiplied, we will get 10 to the power minus 1 and 6.02 and 1.66 will become almost equal to 10. 10 into 10 to the power minus 1 will become almost equal to 1. So 1.008. It is the gram atom of hydrogen atom gram atom of hydrogen atom hydrogen atom so it will be numerically equal to the atomic mass that is relative mass of the hydrogen atom <coughs> thus we can say 1.008 gram of hydrogen it will become equal to 1 mole similarly relative mass of any atom relative mass of any atom is numerically equal to the gram atom of any atom that is 1.008 gram of hydrogen atom is equal to 1.1 1 mole 16 gram of oxygen atom is equal to 1 mole 12 gram 
of carbon you will be equal to 1 mole and so on so mole of mole of the atom may be calculated by using the formula of gram atom that is it is formulated as mole is equal to mass of the atom mass of the atom divided by divided by gram atom gram atom of that atom it is the mathematical formula to calculate the mathematical problems of moles in next video we will discuss the calculation of gram atom and molecular mass thank you